What's going on, y'all, man? We back at it again. It's your boy Bezo with Wheels. Y'all make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe. Hey, look, real quick, I just want to say I deeply appreciate every last subscriber that I have. I just hit 102 subscribers today. So, and I don't have a very big fan base. That means a lot. So, deeply appreciate that. Um, and as a matter of fact, I was actually talking to a subscriber about a video that I posted uh, a while back. It was about the Camaro. And he pretty much asked me, um, what were the steps? And the title of the video was painting a Camaro. So that instantly let me know that I wasn't very descriptive in the video. Um, that didn't discourage me at all. As a matter of fact, I was like, damn, you know what? I'm gonna be a little bit more descriptive in my video. So I appreciate the feedback on that. I appreciate any feedback. I appreciate negative, positive. Uh, it doesn't matter. Leave a comment, thumbs down, thumbs up. That'll just motivate me to make an even better video. If I don't get criticized or I don't get told that I'm effing up in a certain area, then in my mind, I'm gonna think I'm doing everything perfect and I'm only gonna make it so far versus somebody telling me, hey, you should do this, you should do that, you need to do this, you need to do that. Because I haven't been doing this for very long. It's only been like six months, barely that. So I need all the advice I can get. So I definitely appreciate y'all. I appreciate the ones that are subscribed. I appreciate the ones that are not subscribed, but just watching. I actually have this Mustang back here that I wanna make sure if I'm gonna go record it, I'm gonna make sure I'm descriptive about the whole thing from start to finish. I'm actually painting this probably tonight. I wanna try and get it out of here by the night. This is actually going a completely different color. This is going black because somebody did walk around it and key it. Uh, they keyed it and plus the clear coat was chipping and peeling up. So yeah, we're gonna hit this bad boy tonight. I literally wanna get it out tonight. Uh, not on no rushing or anything like that. It's just, um, it has been here for a minute. Uh, I was a little backed up on a truck that I had before. I actually painted a, I think it was like a GMC or something like this, Sierra, one of those. Um, I just re reshot it. It was white. Paint was chipping, doing the same thing. Um, so yeah, we're going to get this bad boy as far as we can get it tonight. Other than that, man, I got a lot of cleaning up to do. We just got, uh, we just got a new toolbox. I'm excited about that. That's cute. I know. I know. It ain't the best, it ain't the biggest, it ain't the best, but it's a start. Um, Mo trash, I gotta clean up, man. I'm telling you, it'd be exhausting. I'll be by myself. So I got a lot of cleaning up to do. Then I'll show y'all what else we didn't. Let's paint the shop. <laughs> yes, we actually did paint the shop, Bahama Blue. Um, just to give us a little motivation when we come out here. <laughs> I know, we might change the color. It do kind of look ridiculous at the same time. But it's actually kind of cool, though, like. Let me see. We still got to hit another coat. We still got like one more coat to hit. But anyway, we got the Cadillac and then we got a box Caprice right here. These two cars are actually one of my homies. Um, He dropped both of them off to get it sprayed, get them both sprayed. These projects are actually projects we're going to take our time on. So, um, yes, I know. Golly. You create more work when you don't get it smoothed down. But like I said, man, I, you know, it's trial and error, man. I ain't done this in five, six years. I ain't done this in school. So, um, anyways, yeah, we got some work to do, man, on both of these cars. So I'm trying to knock out this Mustang. I got a Corvette coming in today. They actually want, uh, it's an older Corvette. Don't ask me what year. I don't know what year. It's an old, old Corvette, though. Um, but these two are going to actually be here for a while because uh, we're going to take our time on them. It's got a lot of body work. So uh, he's not rushing to get them done. Um, as a matter of fact, he comes over here as well to help uh, do the body work and stuff. So this should go fairly smooth. It's not a ton. It's not as bad as a Cadillac. Yes. So we have another uh, coat to hit. So don't disregard. <laughs> and then I think we're going to paint the trim in like light gray or keep it white or whatever. I don't know. We just we just messing around, man. We just kind of having fun. So, um, but yeah, other than that, uh, that's pretty much the rundown. So I just definitely appreciate all my subscribers. I definitely appreciate everybody that watches my videos. Um, camera quality will be upgraded really soon. Got a laptop. I just got to get a camera. And then that's that. Other than that, this is going to be a next video about the Mustang from start to finish. Um, I'm actually going to start sanding on it today. I'll actually show y'all what grit. I'll show y'all everything from start to finish, even masking and all. So Appreciate y'all watching, man. Y'all make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe. If y'all have any questions, concerns, tips, let me know. Feel free to drop it in the comment. Y'all take it easy. Y'all stay blessed. We out.